Okay, what I'm going to do is quickly run through something that comes up in the forums quite often, and that is um, how to increase your um, available processors on a Hyper-V um, on Server 2008 standard. You can see it's got a maximum available processors or logical processors cores of four. Uh, so what we're going to do is just going to bump that up. So what you want to do is make sure that your virtual machine is in the off state uh, and then come in here to the Hyper-V manager and actually stop the service. Okay, then you're going to want to find the um, XML configuration file for your Hyper-V that you're trying to increase the processors on. Uh, mine's in a different location than yours is. I've moved mine to a, to a RAID 10, um, but I'm just going to open that up and actually edit it. I'll use WordPad and it's uh, mine's down toward the bottom what you're looking for you can actually you know do a search for it but it's the tag is processors um, which makes sense so there it is there uh, and you can see the count type equals integer 4 I'm just gonna bump that up I'll give it to 8 on this just for demonstration purposes and I'll save it I'm going to close out. I'm going to come back in here and I'll uh, start my Hyper-V management service. Okay, everything came up, so that's a good sign. I'll just come in here and we'll take a look at the settings. And you can see it shows eight processors, but does it really show eight processors? Let's actually start it up and um, see if it registers in the task manager. And if you're not familiar with, with where these XML files are located and so forth, I mean, or if you're not comfortable editing them, obviously you'd want to make a backup of it, um, of the original file. So you can always leave yourself a path back. Okay, what do we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it appears to have worked. Um, so that's it. That's pretty much all there is to it. Um, whether or not it makes a difference on your performance, I'm not entirely sure. Um, it's just something I wanted to give you guys uh, a demonstration of. So I hope it helps. Thanks.